Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you are already subscribed to me, welcome back. My name is Sierra, and in today's video, we're going to be stuffing the first portion of my first paycheck from July. So I just got paid today, um, so this is the money that I have left um, after I pay my bills. So we're going to stuff that today. Just really quick before we do get started, um, I did go to Starbucks today for the first time in a week pretty proud of myself um but I'm so weird I cannot drink Starbucks without having a straw and they forgot to give me a straw so I'm just gonna pour my Starbucks in my cute little cup real quick and then we're gonna get started y'all don't know how bad I've been craving Starbucks Starbucks is um like far not far but it's like 15 minutes from um, where I live now so I don't go there every day like I used to but oh my god that was great um yeah I don't go there every day like I used to just because it's not super close anymore um but I went to go get my nails done this morning and I decided to stop there on my way home um long story short about my nails so I went to go get a fill this morning and the lady told me that the guy who normally does my nails is sick so hopefully he feels better but I was like you guys could have called me or something so I didn't waste a trip um so I wasn't able to get my nails done but um the girl who normally does them is going to do them at one so after this video I'm going to go do that but yeah we'll go ahead and get started so the first thing I'm going to stuff is my cash envelopes um like I normally do so we're going to start off with groceries so for groceries today it's going to get $50 so we're gonna just give it a 50 and then moving on next envelope is gas so for gas it's gonna get 60 that's what I stuff every week and um, it gives me just enough um, I usually fill my car up once a week and it does last me um, for the whole week so $60 for gas and then next is babies so for babies they are going to be getting $20 today Last weekend, we were supposed to go to um, Wildwood, like I told you guys in my last video, but we ended up um, going to PA instead. I don't know if you guys are familiar with Lancaster, PA. It's so pretty um, and just relaxing. So we went there instead and went to like this nice resort, um, but we're supposed to be going to Wildwood tonight, so we'll see how that turns out. All right, so next envelope is for me. Um, told you guys I haven't been to Starbucks all week really so I still have $20 left so that is good um, so I'm just gonna stuff 10 for myself in this envelope all right and last envelope is gonna be for beauty so beauty is gonna get $20 I already took the money out that was in there um, for my nails today even though I didn't get to get them done yet I wanted to just take it out and keep it in my wallet so 20 for beauty and that is it for the cash envelopes. Um, the next thing I'm going to stuff is my 52 week savings challenge. So this is the challenge to reach $15,000 in one year. Um, this week is week 26. I cannot believe that July is here. This year is halfway over. It's been a crazy one for sure, but um, I'm so happy with how far I've come this year and everything like that. So I really have no complaints. Um, everything is going super good for me so I'm definitely very blessed there I hope everyone else is having a great um, year so far as well I know it's been really challenging with like COVID and all that stuff but it seems to be letting up some so hopefully things are you know going to be fully back to normal soon all right so for the 52 week savings challenge it now has 1,000 2,003 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, and 3. So 8,300. So we'll just set this right up there and then moving on to our long-term sinking funds binder that's going to be this one right here um so the first envelope should be for aston so aston is going to get 125 dollars today 
So that is going to be a $100 bill, a 20 and then a five. A 100, 20 and then a five. So that puts Aspen at 1,000, two, three, four, five, one, two, 20 and five. So 5,225. Alright, so for Alea, she is also going to be getting $125. So $125 20 and 5. So that puts her at 1,000, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 20 and 5 as well. Alrighty guys, moving on to furniture. So for furniture, that envelope is going to be getting $30 today. I've been finding so much cute stuff. Um, I love Z Gallery. They're kind of expensive, but I honestly love their stuff. So I really want to order some stuff from there. Um, I just don't really have anywhere to put it. My storage unit is like packed to the rim. So... Um, yeah, not really sure what to do there, but um, definitely want to order some stuff from them. They're, they have the cutest stuff. All right, so furniture now has 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 40, 60, 80, 5, 20, 40, 60, 80, 6, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, and 7. So 1,700 for furniture. I need to do like a um, another one of those videos where you like condense your sinking funds because mine are just getting too thick at this point. So I'll probably do a video on that in the next couple of um, weeks. All right, so emergency savings already reached that goal. So that just has the placeholder. And then the next envelope is gonna be for my car maintenance. So my car maintenance is going to get $20 today. Um, I really want to get my car wrapped. I don't know if you guys um, have seen like the cars that are wrapped, but I wanna get my car wrapped in olive green so bad, like matte olive green. Um, I saw it a while ago and I just, I really want to do it, but I don't think I can bring myself to pay like $3,000 to wrap my car. I just don't feel like it's worth it, but I've been wanting to do it for a while now, so I might just have to. All right, so car maintenance now has 50, 70, 90, 110, 30, 50, 70, 90, 210, 20, 30, and 40. Alrighty guys, so uh, next envelope is going to be for family. So family time is going to get $20 today. I've been thinking about buying some um, like fireworks to do for 4th of July. I don't really have any plans. I think it's supposed to be rainy, but I don't know. I just want to do fireworks with my kids. So maybe I'll get some like fireworks and just do that. Do you guys have any plans for 4th of July? I feel like it's like a big holiday, but at the same time, it's not really like a huge holiday. I don't know how to explain it. All right. So family time now has 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 50, 60, and 70. So 270. I 
All right, and last envelope for our long-term binder is going to be for investing. I filled out the card for investing. I don't know where I put it, but I never put it in the envelope, obviously. So I guess I'll have to fill out another one. <laughs> um, but investing now has $20, $40, and $60. I told you guys before I used to invest in like the cryptocurrency, um, Bitcoin type of stuff like that. I haven't done it in a while, but I definitely want to get back into it. So I'm going to make that um, a priority here really soon. All right, so that wraps it up for the long-term binder. So we're going to move on to our short-term binder now. All right, so starting off with the first envelope, it's going to be closed. So for clothes, I need to bulk this envelope back up. Um, I just recently ordered myself some clothes and then I saw Fashion Nova was having a sale 50% um, off so I actually ordered myself some fall clothes I just I couldn't resist it so um, yeah this envelope is is getting a little low so we're gonna give it $50 today all right so clothes now has 50 70 90 110 20 30 and 40 God, I forgot to show you guys this pen. How cute is this pen? I think I'm going to use this one now instead. I love cheetah print, leopard print, whatever you want to call it. It's my favorite color. All right, so next envelope is for Christmas. So Christmas is getting $30 today. Oh, it writes nice too. So Christmas is getting a 20 and a 10. So that puts Christmas at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 50, 70, 90, 7, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99. 800, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Ooh, so $810 for Christmas. I definitely need to um, break this envelope down. It's getting super thick. All right, so next envelope is going to be for gifts. So for gifts, it's gonna get $20 today. This envelope got a little bit low because I had to get my mom a birthday gift. Um, so we're adding 20 to this. So that puts the gift at 1, 20, 40, 50, and five. Alrighty guys, next envelope is going to be for my vacation. Um, so this vacation envelope is no longer set for Vegas. I already took that thousand and put it in the bank. Um, so I know someone asked me in a comment if I'm using a placeholder for it and no I am not. Um, just because I'm starting saving for a new vacation. So this is going to be for a cruise. I'm going to go on in either January or February. I haven't booked the cruise just yet. Um, but I'm going to start searching for that here soon. Um, I know I want to go somewhere to like the Caribbean. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm going to do with this envelope. So it's getting $50 today, which will put this one at 100 And then that is it. Now I have this $50 bill left over. Um, that $50 bill is actually for a new challenge that I'm starting. So I'm going to just set it to the side right here and I'm going to be making a video. I'll probably film it tomorrow morning um, and upload it at some point tomorrow. I do have plans tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes. Um, but I'm doing a new challenge, so I'll explain to you guys everything in that video. I'm excited to film that. Um, but yeah, that's what that $50 is for. And then that wraps it up for our short term binder here. 
so that is it for today's video guys i hope you all enjoyed it um i don't really have too much else to say for today besides i hope you all enjoy your weekend and i hope you guys have a great fourth of july stay tuned for my next video um and i will show you all my new challenge but that is it i will see you all in my next video bye guys